Deadly fire in New York's Trump Tower is raising safety concerns over high-rise residential buildings. Saturday's fire on the tower's 50th floor killed a 67-year-old art collector. The unit did not have sprinklers because they were not required when Trump Tower opened in 1983. One New York City Council member wants sprinklers put in all of the city's residential high-rises. He also had a message for President Trump. Donald Trump has always been a powerful player in this city. Um, and, and I don't hold him responsible, but he could have been more responsible and let his voice be heard around the safety of New Yorkers. Saturday's fire was the second one in Trump Tower this year. An electrical fire in January hurt two civilians and a firefighter. The Secret Service has spent more than $60,000 on elevator inspections in Trump Tower since the election.